Alright, welcome back to another episode of Let's Play MLB The Show 24 Road to the Show. Okay. Alright, we're in LA Here's against the Dodgers. Freeman. Let's do this. Freddie Freeman. Here comes a pinch. On the ground. Oh, and it hits the base. Fair ball. Around first and hustling for second. The throw in. And he'll pull into second safely. He needed that one. It's been a tough stretch to plate lately. Just a simple ground ball the other way. They had eyes on it, man. Sometimes it's... Here's Mookie Betts. This one lifted in the air, left field. Base hit, around third. Here's the throw to the plate. Got him! Ha <laughs> Here's the left fielder, having a huge season. Comes into the day, leading the league in two of the three triple crown categories. And... <clears throat> now this is in the air down the line. Sizes this one up. And makes the play, and that's out number three. And a foul ball. The 0-1. Lace down the line, and now maybe extra bases. Around first, heading for two. And now the tying run is into scoring position. And now the right fielder, Walker Jenkins. And a pitch. And there's ball four. He's making things difficult for himself right now out there on the mound, but, you know, his confidence should still be high enough to get out of this, but he's going to have to buckle down right here. Left field on his way over. Brings it in. The throw in double play. Second. Damn it. Second with the throw in. No chance to get back. It's a double play. Hand is all they get. One down. Chris Taylor steps mm -hmm. to the plate no, for the Dodgers. Wants. Come on. Swing and a high fly ball to left. Pulls it yeah. down and makes the catch. And yeah, there's two away. Here we get the lead. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, uh. Fly ball down the line. This has got a chance. And it is foul. Well, that's where you want to be right there. All over that first pitch fastball. Just a little too much hook on it. Straighten that thing out. You get to jog around the bases. Line drive, and that's a base hit into center field. The run comes in from second. It's 5-3. Well, Singy, okay. he is locked in there. Well, he's really slowed the game down, and it's like he's moving in full speed, and everybody is a step or two behind. The way that he squared up that baseball tells me. Runner takes off. Swing and a miss. One, two. Throw to second. Out at second. That. Now the left fielder. So clutch. You could argue that he's been this team's MVP this year. This one driven. Deep center field on its way. Home run. A gigantic black. One down. Here's the left fielder. And it may be a long shot, but a triple here will give him the cycle. Now a screamer into the outfield. Grabs it on the run. Two down. Man, that's one of those. Number 24 really stood out in this win. Had three hits, one of them a homer. No question, he was a big piece of their success in this the ball game. Line, Fantastic ball effort at the plate. For the big now the left fielder. So easy to look at the big boys in this lineup, but he has been a pleasant surprise all season long. <clears throat> On a line, base hit. They fired in quickly. 
So it's first and second with only one away. Connor Joe, the next twin up to hit. On the ground, two ball. Freeman over to second. Return throw to first. Got him. Double play. And that. Come on. Come on. Give me something I can hit here. Ground ball left side. Damn it. No double play. Second, there's one on the Freddy. Double play. And now it's Max Muncy. And we're down. We're losing. Great. Right hander kicks deals. That one the other way. Drops in for a hit. Couldn't run it down. Runner from second crosses the play. It's 5 2. And he's got a double. Puts a run on the board and picks up an RBI. Put a really nice balanced swing on it. And when you can rope one into the gap like that, you're thinking extra bases from the first couple of steps out of the box. And he'll feel real good about that one. Brings it in with. Now battle. Line drive, come on! Well, baseball can be cruel, can it? I don't care if you're a top team or you're a middle of the pack team. Every ball club wants to be dominant at home. Winning a game like this just helps to boost the confidence and makes you look forward to coming out again for the next one. Number 24 digs in now. Down six, nothing. Wow. Swung on, belted. That's back there. And that one is out of here. A massive home run. So one out, nobody on. And the batter now, Mookie Betts. And that's a fair ball. Now he'll turn for second. The throw in. In there safely. Well, a big yeah. lead like this is comfortable many times, but no not when these two teams right. are matching up. you got to continue to keep your head down, play catch with that catcher, and just try to move through this lineup. And there's a hit. So a man yeah, aboard yeah, now is one away. Pick up the ball. Well, Singy, he is locked in there. Well, he's really slowed the game down, and it's like he's moving in full speed, and everybody is run around the goal. Makes the grab for the second out. To the bag himself. It's a double. One hit, no error. Ellie De La Cruz steps to the plate for the Dodgers. The pitch. That's ripped. Base hit. Around first. Digging for two. Throws to second. The tag, and they cut him down, going for two. And we're back. Top of inning number seven. And now for the Twins, number 24. Otani back to work. Swings and blasts one deep to left center. That's long gone. He came out of his shoes on that one. The batter now will be Will Smith. The one two. In the air, left field. Diving makes the grab. Timing, timing, timing. That's what this play is all about. A beautiful sliding grab in the outfield and no advancement on the bases. You couldn't have scripted it any better. Line drive, base hit. Lead runner around second. The throw to third. He's in there. And his hot hitting continues. And a foul ball. Well, it's critical right here that they bear down and turn in some quality at bats. Try to chip away at that lead because if it gets to the ninth, that closer's coming in. There's a swing and a drive. You got it. Go to, go to. Hops over the wall, and that's an automatic double. 
So two down. So up next for Minnesota, Walker Jenkins. And the pitch. And that's ball four. Second walk of the game for him, and he's been really patient at the play, the game plan that he's sticking to. He's just not going outside of what he's looking for up there. Swing and a ball lifted in the air. Shallow left field. No trouble here. Puts That's the third out. Triple digit wins. A hundred wins. That's hard to even look at. You kind of blink your eyes to make sure that it says... Okay, we're playing the Astros now. Let's go. Here's Kyle Tucker. That's a hit. Lead runner makes the turn at second. Throw into third. He's in there. Now the left fielder. So easy to look at the big boys in this lineup, but he has been a pleasant surprise all season long. Swung on, belted. That one is back. And it is out of here. Into the second deck. And now it's Alex Bregman. Alex Bregman. And a pitch. Into left center for a base hit. Lead runner around second. The throw in. Got him. And he's out easily. <laughs> and we're back. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And now for the Twins, number 24. And first offering is fouled off. A wind in the pitch. Foul ball. He's got one already tonight. I wouldn't be surprised if he pops another one here. Foul ball still 0-2. Hey, Gets a piece and stays alive. Here comes a pitch. On the ground. And that should be extra bases. Make the turn. Go hard. Go hard. Around first, heading for two. Throws to second. Not going to get him. He's in there. Well, Singy, he is locked in there. Well, he's really slowed the game down. And it's like he's moving in full speed, and everybody is a step or two behind. The way that he squared up that baseball tells me that he is seeing it like a beach ball. Walker Jenkins, the next twin up to him. Runner in scoring position, nobody out. You're in game one of this three-game set. In the air, left field. Alvarez makes the grab, one away. Now batting, center fielder, Garrett. Mitchell Garrett Mitchell the next twin up to him singing you got to appreciate a guy who's this good defensively I mean watching him track balls in the outfield it is beautiful man at second bounce to the right side sends it to first two down the first baseman number two Connor Connor Joe will hit next this guy at the dish excels in two strike counts. Got to be careful with him out there on the mound. And he deals. This to third. Bregman. Tosses to first. And that is that. Twins wind up stranding one as they can't add to their 4 2 lead. So up next, number 24, and he had a big swing of the bat early on in the ballgame. 
Yep, a three-run rocket back in the second. Even though it was early, a big homer like that can be tough to come back from when you're on the other end of that thing. I mean, it's tough. Sets up an uphill battle the rest of the way. And that's in for a strike. There it was. Oh, oh, here it is. Hit it. He gets a take. Gets ahead in the count. Mm. Swings and fouls one off. Been a solid inning so far in relief. Getting them through this inning only down two could give their lineup a real opportunity to just grind their way back in the... That one ripped. And it's off the wall. Now a relay to second, but he's in there easily. And his hot hitting continues. They kept him in the yard that time, but all he's doing now is passing the baton, and everything seems to get started around this guy. So two down, and now the right fielder, Walker Jenkins. The bottom of the order here, Boog. you got to go right after this guy. As they look to pick up an add-on run, and the number nine guy at the plate. Kicks and fires. Hard on the ground to first. He takes it himself oh. to the bag, and that'll do it. One left for Minnesota, but they still lead this one 4-2. to two. Here's the left fielder. He's already homered in this game. He's been such a good hitter with runners in scoring position. Some guys just take it to another level. For him right now at the plate, it's like everyone else is in slow motion and he's in full speed. You can do it. Let's go, man. a base hit. Correa around third. He'll score easily. And they're pulling away up by seven now. Picks himself up at RBI. I can watch base hits like that one all day long and so could every hitting coach in the league. Just a nice line drive into center field. Two outs. Runner at first. Walker Jenkins digs in now. Hey, what time? Right now. The Twins up big in this one here, the bottom half of the eighth inning. Swung on, broken back grounder to third. They get the force, and they're happy to just get off the field after that frame. But nine batters hit in the inning, five come around to score. Through eight full, Twins nine, and the Astros two. performance out of the pen. This guy is not the one who usually gets the final out, but extended his role a little bit and helped his team get the win. He got the save. Nice job. The final line score for our ball game tonight for the victorious Twins. Nine runs on nine hits. Two errors, they left three runners on base. For the Astros, two runs, ten hits. Number 24, Batting the next twin up to the left hit. Field. Number 24. This one in the air center field. McCormick makes the grab and that's the inning. Twins wind up stranding one. We'll move to the third with no score. Hey, we got one. And stepping in for the Astros, Spencer Steer. Lifted in the air down the left side and it falls. Around second is Pena to third and he's out. We head to the bottom of the fifth. Stepping in the long ball threat, number 24. Liner, base hit. So a runner aboard to start the inning. Yeah. 
Well, Tack, one more game onto his hitting streak, Boo. Every day, this guy just keeps making his record harder and harder to reach. I still can't believe what he's doing. Yeah, neither can I. It's like he's playing on beginner mode out there. Into the outfield base hit. Well, that may end up being an at-bat. We go back to later on when this game is over. Not much to this one other than just a willingness to go the other way and put the ball in play. That's a team at bat right there. Nice job of staying back and letting the ball get deep. On the ground, a second might be two. Drops yeah. it, but they're saying it was on the transfer. One down. Now the number two hitter. Lefty out of the stretch. Runners at first and third. Drilled to right, way back there, and that is gone. That one was a hanger. And now it's Jordan Alvarez. The pitch. Lined, and that's a base hit. Lead runner touches second, headed for third. The throw in, in there safely. Well, his hot hitting continues. He's been... Second and third, one gone. And next to hit for Houston, Yaner Diaz. And a pitch. Left field. Sizes this one up. Squeezes it. Runner tags for home. Here's the throw to the plate. It's offline, and he scores. And now they trail by one. That one is absolutely belted. Back there. And out of here. That'll fire up the dugout. His second home run of the series. And they tack on to their lead. It's six. All set for the start of the inning. Now it's going to be Jeremy Pena. He swings and drives one out to deep left field. That's down. One hops off the wall into second easily with a leadoff double. Everything came together perfectly for him right there. Now the left fielder. He's already homered here in this one. Ripped into right center. And that should be extra bases. Two, Jeffers. Two, two, two. Round second on his way to third. Coming home. He will score. It's seven to two. Well, Singy, he is locked in there. Well, he's really slowed the game down, and it's like he's moving in full speed, and everybody is a step or two behind. The way that he squared up that baseball tells me that he is seeing it like a beach ball. Manuel Margot up to the plate. Man on second, two down. To the right side. Inning over, and it could have been worse. Number 24 really excelled in this one and contributed to the win. Put together three hits, one of them a home run. I'll tell you, Boog, I was excited every time he came up when a player is locked in like he was. On the ground to the left, and it goes just foul. Hitter's got some good opposite field power. What I like about something being hit to the right side into the outfield is that the base runner at second has a very good read and can determine whether or not he can score on that base hit. Gets a piece there. We'll do it again. No outs. Runner on second. Foul ball. It stays nothing in two. And now the lefty stays alive. Hammers that one deep left field and forget it. They must be going crazy in the dugout. So next up for Houston, Gabriel Curran. Righty delivers. There's a line drive to left field. That's a base hit. Lead runner makes the turn at second. Throw to third, save. I could have had him. At the corners to start the I should have threw it to third. That was now my the bad. Stop, Jeremy Pena.
Swing and a ball lifted in the air. Shallow left field. And he makes the catch. Runner tagging from third. Fires it to the plate. Tag. Too late. He scores. And it's a one-run game. Bottom of the inning. Here's the left fielder. Number 24. That one fouled off. And the pitch. Well struck left field. Alvarez going back on it. Out of here. He sends it into the second deck. His second home run of the game. It's 3-1. is going to haunt him for a while. An 0-2 mistake. That's supposed to be a pitch out of the zone. He left it in the spot that the hitter could do some. We go to the top of the seventh. At the plate is the Astros catcher, Yaner Diaz. This is a guy who is very highly regarded defensively. Fun to watch him control stuff behind the plate. Good game caller, good at framing, but it's that big arm that really stands out. That one lifted to left, and it falls. pitch this ball's chopped to the ground and that's just foul the 0 one and that one fouled off liner and that should be extra bases makes the turn and heads for second and he greets the new arm from the bullpen with a double. The first base hit, number two. Connor Joe getting ready to hit. The pitch. Swing and a pop-up. Current drifts towards it. Current brings it in to second with the throw in. No chance to get back if back in Minnesota. New inning getting started. Now it's Alex Bregman. In the air, left side. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And there's one down. This is why they turn to him to close out games. He's so reliable in these spots, and he just proved it for the 35th time this season. Nice. Twins win, baby. Okay.
Now it's Jose Ramirez. High fly ball out towards left field. That one's carrying. Leaping, and he brought it back. Timing, timing, timing. That's what this play is all about. A beautiful cool. sliding grab in the outfield and no good. advancement on the bases. You couldn't have scripted it any better. So now it's the four-hole hitter, Kyle Manzardo. Two outs. Line drive, base hit. Lead runner touches second, headed for third. The throw in. Safe, not in time to get him, and it's first and third with two away. Back here in Cleveland, new inning getting started. Here's the left fielder, number 24. Swing and a foul over the screen and back out of play. Smash to center, way back, and you can forget it. Home run. The guy's got a real heart. The batter, number 24. <clears throat> Swing, and that ball smashed on a line. <laughs> Damn it. it. down, and there's two gone. The Guardians going with it. Here's Andres Jimenez. Two down, nobody on. That one down the line, and it kicks off the base, and it stays fair. Around first, heading for two. Throws to second, and he's out. Cut down, and that ends the... It really feels like we might be running out of time before a rain delay is called. This rain is not letting up. Yeah. This one smoked out to left. Brings it in. Runner tags from third. Play at the plate. Safe, and they take the lead. It was all over that battle. No outs, runner at first. Now the left fielder, he's already homered here in this one. Hammered down the line, and now maybe extra round bases. It, round it, round it, round it, Adamas, around second, headed for third. Coming home, relay throw home, head for a slide, and he's safe. Well, Singy, he is locked in there. Well, he's really slowed the game down, and it's like he's moving in full speed, and everybody is a step or two behind. The way that he squared up that baseball tells me that he is seeing it like a beach ball. In the air, left field, down the line, dives, and it gets by. Let's go, let's go, 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 he's going, he's going, he's going. Around third, the relay to the plate, safe. Here's the left fielder. He's already homered in this game. Ripped base hit. Correa on his horse and coming home. He will score, and it's a double-digit lead as they're up by ten. The batter. Sheesh, Singy, that was a laser shot, and a good thing we have Statcast to give us the details. Yeah, get out of the way on that one. That ball flew out of the box at 112 miles per hour. You talk about generating a ton of power in that swing. He did it with quick hands, good lower half, and just unloaded on that ball. Hey. Tries to get back and save. Well, he didn't get the call on the mound the pitch before. Felt like he should have had him looking, I think. But, you know, that's good composure right there. He found a way to come back with another good pitch to get him to swing and miss. Runner takes off. Swing and a miss. Out at third. And that ends the inning. After four wins in a row, you start to think a little bit that you're on a roll, and that's the momentum that just takes on a life of its own. Players start hitting up and down the lineup. Never know who's going to come up with the big hit, who's going to come out of the bullpen and get the big hit. <clears throat> Damn it. No. And that is that. Uh, you know, I'm making a call here. Home run. Home run. Damn it. Hard hit left side. Oh, beat it out. Beat it out. First, that's out number three. 
bottom of the inning. Stepping up for the Guardians, Chase DeLauder. And it stays fair. Makes the turn and heads for second. The throw in. In there safely. Well, the last 10 games or so have been anything but. Back now at Progressive Field. All set for the top of the six. Here's a big power threat. Number 24. Oh, now this one's blasted deep to left. Way back there. On its way and out of here. He made him pay for that one. His latest homer in an Ready to go for the last half of the inning. So in now for Cleveland, Ezekiel Tovar. In the air, left field. Drifts towards it. And there's one down. He was all over that first pitch back. And now the right fielder, Chase DeLauder. This one smacked out to left center. That's a base hit. Lead runner around second. Throw into third. And the throw's offline, safe at third. The bat. Now the cleanup hitter for Minnesota. His next home run will be the 200th in his career. It would be pretty cool to see it right here. That one ripped. Pulls it in on the warning track. Not fooled at all. But a real nice performance out of the pen. This guy is not the one who usually gets the final out, but extended his role a little bit and helped his team get the win. He got the save. Nice job. Here's Andres Jimenez. Kicks and deals. In the air, left side. And that'll fall for a base hit. All right, I'm one homer shy of 200 for my career. Be awesome if I can actually get it in this game. Cleveland up around, looking for more. Hard ground ball, base now. Headed for the plate. Now a long throw home, and he's out. Yeah. So two down. down the All right, field. here we go. Home run number 200. Here we go. In his career. It would be pretty cool Damn it! Right I want, I want, I want to hit number two hundred. All right, next at bat, next at bat. That's all right, next at bat. And now for the Twins, Walker Jenkins. The pitch, missing inside, and that's ball one. There's a strike. Back to back fastballs in. That last one called for a strike. Probably go away, but look for him to come back in there to try to finish you off. The kick and the pitch. Runner goes. There's a ball. Go to second. Out there. And he here in Cleveland, Bo Naylor at the plate now. That one the other way. Full extension makes the catch. Batting seven, the left fielder. Now batting number twenty-four. All right, here we go. And a foul ball. I'm trying to hit number two hundred right here. My two hundred career home run. One down, base is empty. Crush. There it is. Center field. This one's deep. Forget it. Number two hundred. gigantic blast that's his third home run of the series and just like that they're out front it's 2-1 singy somebody go track down that baseball it's number 200 for him 200 career home runs that's legitimate power at the plate and that's something that a lot of guys would dream of getting to he came out of his shoes on that one but managed is absolutely belted that's back there number 201 nope just shy of the wall runner tags and goes to third thought that was a no doubt like the win now it's jose ramirez swung on belted come on that one carrying 
Browner tags it second, and he moves up to third. Now two away. Here's the left fielder. He's already homered here in this one. Right side, hard hit. Toss to Naylor, two away. And we got the victory. We're going to the playoffs, guys. Next. All right. You know what? We got the playoffs. We got the playoffs, guys. Um, who are we playing in the first round? Let's find out. All right, game one of the American League Division Series next time as we will be taking on the Texas Rangers. We'll see you guys then. Be sure you guys like, comment, share, and subscribe to our content, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.